year's Realtor of the Year is described as someone who handles all transactions with accuracy and professionalism, spends many hours to help the CCAR, is a great leader, is respected, has high integrity, and holds the following designations. SFR, CDPE, has served on the following CCAR committees. Multiple Listing Service Committee, Technology Department Working Group, Contract Working Group, and served as Secretary Treasurer, President-Elect, President, and Past President. Was first licensed in Illinois in 1998, joined the Champaign County Association of Realtors in May of 1998. We warmly present the Realtor of the Year 2013 to Matt DeFond. She did just hand me the mic, so be very worried. <laughs> yes, sir. She's got, a, she's got a height advantage, she'll take me down. I am very thankful for the honor, I'm really humbled, but I, I have a couple, a handful of people I need to thank. First of all, I've spent countless hours happily uh, giving back to our association, and I couldn't do that if I didn't have my wife Angel, who is here this evening. who was like scrambling very frequently just today. I forgot one of the children and she was uh, able to scramble <laughs> and pick him up before the authorities got called and got there first. So thank you, Angel, for all that you do for us. And then the other thing is, I couldn't do this if I didn't have a team that covers things so well. I could not possibly put the number of hours into it that I do if I had to worry that all of my business was going to fall apart every time I'm ruining your lives by tweaking the contract. Um, and so thank you to everyone on my team. Jeffrey, Jamie, Tracy, Caitlin, those guys make sure that everything stays working. And lastly, many of you know that I have a law school education, but I don't know how many of you know why I went to law school. Anyone? Anyone? I determined Tom? <laughs> because it was so pompous that it seemed like a natural outlet. No, but... <laughs> I went to law school because I've been in this business first. I did real estate first for a couple of years, and after a couple of very, very slow income years getting started, I had determined with absolute certainty I was not destined to make any sort of a living in real estate. And that was why I went to law school. And then it was through a lot of hard work in graduate school full-time while I was selling real estate full-time that I managed to double my business, and therefore didn't have any income rationale to change careers. And so I feel like I have been extraordinarily blessed in this business. As Russ Taylor has frequently said, people who work really hard in this business and are able to achieve a high level of success make doctor money without as much, still some, but not as much blood. So to, to be able to achieve that level of success, I am extraordinarily blessed. I am honored to be in the profession with all of you. And I feel like, as the Apostle Paul writes in, I think it's Luke 12, 48, to whomsoever much is given, of him much is required. And I feel like I've been extraordinarily blessed by this industry, blessed by all of you, blessed to be in this business, and I very cheerfully love the opportunity to give back and hopefully make the profession a better one for all of us. So again, thank you so much. Congratulations to Matt. Congratulations to everyone.